so the the cost of the radio is <laughs> I'm here with Joe, and what's your call sign? N4KYS. And what is this new, amazing, is this Android on a phone radio? Yes, yes, this is the Comjot CJ1. Uh -huh. It is the world's first open source Android DMR dual band radio. DMR dual band radio. Yes. Awesome. And uh, what Android is it running? Android 14. 14? Yes, one of the latest versions of Android, tier one, tier two, DMR with AES-256 encryption, fully unlocked 136 to 174, 400 to 480 megahertz. So it'll do amateur radio and GMRS and, you know, FRS and commercial frequencies as well. Nice, nice. And it looks like in a waterproof rugged box? Waterproof rugged, slim, um, a fully compatible with all the cellular networks. It's in the process of getting its GSR, um, GSM certificate um, to be licensed to be on AT&T, T-Mobile, and Verizon. Uh -huh. um, and one of the things that makes this radio most special is its open source platform. And what that means is people from all over the world can contribute plugins that allow this radio to be expanded. We have two major announcements with, uh, with the plugins. The first one is um, about a month ago, we got a commitment from the Worldwide Repeater Directory to have their data available within this for instant access to the, the repeater directory. Cool. But today at Hamvention, we got the confirmation from Garrett, the owner of Repeater Book. He is also going to have a plug-in available in this radio, so you will have the option of pulling repeater live repeater data from either the Repeater Book or the Worldwide Repeater Directory. Oh, that's pretty cool. So that's all going on the phone within the, your DMR app, or how's that going to work? Yeah, within the actual um, open source radio app. So the radio app will allow you to do FM and DMR, um, but with the plugins, um, you could theoretically put software codec on this radio that would allow you to do C4 FM or DM um, D star and transmit that audio over the air so it wouldn't just be limited to network connectivity it would also be able to um, pipe the incoming audio through a software codec and then put the output over the air awesome awesome how many watts five watts on VHF and UHF beautiful beautiful do you have a timetable you want to share with us? yes yes so they are taking pre-orders for this radio today gigaparts. Pre-orders. Pre-orders for this radio. The GSM certificate is scheduled to be complete June 1st. We are expecting the radios to ship by June 15th. All right, so since you said pre-orders, how much? The the cost of the radio is $9.99. $9.99? Well, thank you very much, Joe, and I'm looking forward to it. Sounds good, man. Have a good hand fest. Thanks.